today uh Jichopevu Muhammad Ali the MP from Mombasa accompanied uh the president William Ruto when he was touring the Kamba region Muhammad Ali was given a chance to speak to the people of the Kamba region we all remember Muhammad Ali was among the first MP from Mombasa region to announce his support to the president I remember very well during this period, very many people never wanted to associate themselves with the then deputy president of Kenya, William Ruto. And I remember when uh, William Ruto wanted to visit the Mombasa region, he was received by only one MP. In fact, very many people came out to mock him, to mock him that he's going to lose with the deputy president. So, among the very few people who have been loyal to William Ruto is Muhammad Jichopevu. In fact, Muhammad Jichopevu came out to breathe fire to teach Rail Odinga on how to go about the, pro the protests which are being held. Let me first give you a video as Muhammad Ali is uh, breathing fire, but also asking William Ruto to come out and protect the citizens hauwezi tafuta uongozi kwa njia ya kuua watoto wa Jamhuri ya Kenya. Hawa watu ndio walienda kwa debe kupiga kura na kuchagua rais wanayetaka. Kama hawakukupenda na hukupendwa na upendeki, kaa kando uache kazi ifanywe. Watu sita waliuawa ile maandamano iliyopita. Ya jana sasa ni nane. Tukiweka askari pale wanasema oh sio sisi ni askari wanaharibu maandamano ya amani. Tukiondoa askari wanaua raia, wanaibia raia, wanachoma maduka, wanaua hata polisi. Your Excellency waswahili wanasema dawa ya moto ni Hatuwezi kuwa tukibembelezana na punda kwa mteremko. Wewe kila mara ni ghasia, wewe kila mara ni fujo. Hakuna siku mdomo wako ulimi wako utatamka amani. Na ukiona hawa wan GB wameanza kufuata rais wa Jamhuri ya Kenya, ujue hiyo upumbavu hatutakubali safari hii. Muache rais afanye kazi yake. Si mlimchagua afanye kazi. Sasa walituacha na deni. Waliua watoto wetu, wakawatupa kule Rivayala. Wengine wakatupa huko Thika, wengine huko Mombasa. Waliongeza bei ya chakula kwa sababu wao ndio wanaagiza hizi chakula. Bei ya mafuta waliongeza kwa sababu petrol station zote ni zao, gas ni yao. Wakatuuzia unga 230 hawakufanya maandamano wakati walikuwa kwa serikali, si ndio? Muliona Raila Odinga kwa maandamano akiwa kwa serikali? Muliona Uhuru Kenyatta kwa maandamano? Eh kwa sababu walikuwa wanakula wakifunga macho. Sasa mnataka kusumbua rais Muache rais afanye kazi akifeli baada ya miaka mitano sinyi ndio mtaamua kuna haja tuamuliwe na maandamano kwa hivyo rais tupatie rusa na wale maafisa wa polisi ambao bado wanadhani wako katika handshake waamke kumekucha hatutakubali musabotage serikali ya William Samoe Ruto so that was Muhammad Ali when he was talking about the protest in, in Kenya first of all it is true that the bedrock on which the UDA foundation was built in Mombasa is Muhammad Ali. Muhammad Ali was among the few people from Mombasa who came out to support the UDA candidate in William Ruto. I wish you could be given a more bigger position in parliament, okay, because he stood firm and supported his candidate till when he, he won. We all remember when Muhammad Ali was laying a foundation in Mombasa for the UDA, he fought a lot of people, including the, the, the then kingpin, Joho. So to me, I take Muhammad Ali as one of the loyal people in Mombasa. Some people are coming out to say that even Hassan Omar is also a force to reckon with. But for me, uh, I think Muhammad Ali is well poised to take the leadership of Mombasa uh, within the UDA. So, that was Muhammad uh, Ali for you. And I think he still has his finger on the trigger as far as political battles, uh, uh, as far as politics is concerned in Mombasa. Uh, and I remember last, was it last week, 
there was a mini fight, a sibling rivalry between Hassan Omar and Muhammad Ali. I think this fight was to see who is supposed to take the flag of Mombasa for as far as uh, uh, UDA is concerned in the region. But also, if you look closely in Mombasa politics, you see a, the loud silence of uh, Joho. Joho was among the campaigning team of Baba, but ever since they lost an election, I've not seen Joho anywhere in the Mombasa politics. Even the incumbent governor right now is not involved anywhere in the Royal Odinga politics. So I think Mombasa is up for grabs uh, by the UDA because I don't see anyone assertive in Mombasa. I don't see anyone keeping the fire burning for the ODM party and for Azmio at large. So it was a masterstroke to get Muhammad Ali in, in the UDA and I think what he needs is just support from the government so that he can consolidate the support, also get more support from the Mombasa region. If you see closely, Nasir, the current governor of Mombasa, is, is nowhere to be seen in the Mombasa politics, even at the national level. In fact, you could prefer Joho to be governor because Joho used to work as in Fubaba. So, Mama Dali has come out to fight for the UDA consolidation within the Mombasa region. That is what I think. That was my observation. Thank you very much for listening in. If this is your first time on this YouTube channel, I employ you to subscribe, like, and comment so that I can be motivated to do more of such videos.